Can you name this alien looking fruit? I'll give you a hint. It rhymes with khaki. It's called an aki, and it happens to be one of the deadliest fruits in the world. But just because it's deadly doesn't mean it's inedible. Are you sure? It's the national fruit of Jamaica, and it's enjoyed on other Caribbean islands like Haiti, Trinidad, and Barbados, although it's not indigenous to the Caribbean. Where does this strange fruit come from? What does it taste like? What makes it so deadly? And since it's deadly, how and why do people eat it? Keep watching to find out the answers, because if you're ever picking fruit in Jamaica, our tips might save your life. Aki fruits grow on evergreen trees that reach heights of up to 15 meters and grow throughout the island of Jamaica. It was originally grown in the Guinean forests of West Africa, in countries like Ghana and Benin. Around 1788, during the transatlantic slave trade, aki was brought to Jamaica. It eventually became a staple. The edible part is called the arrow. It hides under the glossy black eye-like seeds. As a member of the soapberry family, aki is related to the lychee, longan, and guarana. Fans love aki for its versatility, as it can be eaten fresh, dried, fried, and roasted, or made into sauce and soup. When it's cooked, it may look like scrambled eggs, but its flavor is described as resembling peanut butter with sweet, fruity notes. Because of its soft, buttery texture, it's often pureed and made into cake, custard, and ice cream. Jamaica's national dish is aki and codfish, sometimes called saltfish. Oh. oh, wow. Cooks boil the salt cod and then add onions, tomatoes, and boiled aki arils. Sometimes sweet peppers, allspice, and fiery scotch bonnet peppers are added. This dish is typically served with fried plantains, dumplings, or rice. Sounds good, right? But beware. If you eat unripe aki, it can quickly turn from a delicious national dish to a deadly encounter. The unripe fruit contains a toxic amino acid called hypoglycin A. It will inhibit your body's ability to produce glucose, causing a sudden decrease in blood sugar. You may also experience Jamaican vomiting sickness, or JVS. The symptoms begin about 2 to 12 hours after eating the unripe fruit and include vomiting, loss of consciousness, and seizures. If left untreated, JVS can kill. Since 1980, 271 cases of JVS have been reported in Jamaica, and in 2001, 36 people died of JVS within three months. Oh, great. I'm all for adventurous eating, but you better know your stuff before chowing down on mysterious fruits. Are you sure this won't kill me? And it's not just the fresh fruit that's dangerous. You can get sick from canned varieties, too. So it's important to consume Aki canned by FDA-approved brands. Despite its inherent dangers, Aki has pretty awesome health benefits. Aki contains many essential minerals like potassium, magnesium, and calcium. So while eating Aki may sound scary, you can enjoy this unique tropical fruit as long as it's ripe and you know what you're doing. A ripe Aki fruit has a red exterior. It will also be split open, exposing its big black seeds. Some Jamaicans say the fruit is yawning or smiling when it's ready to be picked. Separate the fleshy fruit from the seeds and the red lining, voila! You have a delicious, nutritious, not deadly, treat from Mother Nature herself. Aki is still primarily consumed in the Caribbean and West Africa. But who knows, maybe one day we'll see it on every grocery shelf of North America. Anything's possible, right? But if dangerous tropical fruits aren't your thing, maybe you should try something more neutral, like tofu. Find out how tofu went from a relatively unknown food ingredient in the U.S. to a grocery store staple in another episode of Origins of Food.